Hello, Galaxy of Heroes. I'm about to go into a uh, fleet battle. This is the fleet that I'm running at the moment. I'm trying out the Sith, uh, plus a bounty hunter, or Sith and Empire. So it's, a, it's an all dark side fleet. Um, here's my Hound's Tooth. It's actually, is that maxed? I'm, right. Okay. Um, I very rarely use him in thing. Uh, I need him in the starting lineup to protect my Sith because they're very, very squishy. Um, the reason that I'm recording this is because here's my Bosque. Been working on my Bosque. I did some uh, remodding, so I've got four. Four of them are now six E. Uh, they're not super great. Uh, it's only 14 speed there, 15 speed here. I kind of acted in haste, 14 there, and oh dear, 11. Uh, I did have this one. This started off earlier today, didn't record it. Started off green showing 8 speed, and speed's turned two more times. Yay, so it's up to 18 and onto my Bosque. So my Bosque is clocking and currently at 274 speed and there's all these other stats but i've got this so it's going to add 2000 health it's going to add 40 agility six speed 100 physical damage and 85 uh physical critical chance there are other tu tunes that are even tunes as well. Yeah, there are other tunes. And there are, of course, other tunes who would benefit from this. But it's a crew member. And I want to see what it will do to uh, Hound's Tooth stats. So I farmed. I, I was in. I, I had a lot of shards already for Hound's Tooth. And when he became, or when it became farmable, I spammed it an awful lot. So there's the health. Look at that. 94k health. And another 77, almost 78k protection. 142 speed. So that will increase. I've got another speed or one to go on there, I believe, when I make the two purple mods gold. 6e's i think that'll add up one more speed but for now let's just craft and equip done it's like pulling a band-aid you do it really fast and then it doesn't hurt so much i'll click into here so here he is now 38 743 health 57 184 protection 280 speed that's nice, he's clocking a bit more, 10% health still, 101 armor pen, 2% dodge chance, zero resistance penetration, yeah, but there are all his stats. Uh, I scrolled through slowly, so if there's any there that you were more interested in seeing, they're there if you wish. I'm still I'm in an R in about, you know what, sod it, I'm going to do it. Boof, it's done. Wow, almost 8k. Whoa. Okay. So what did that do? Nothing on there because it's a Zeta. <laughs> it doesn't have any impact on any of those stats. What it will mean is that he will gain taunt for one turn if the weakest enemy has protection still uh, there you go that's one in that's one for the guild and territory wars so here now is the ship which is where we started so crew power 37192 ship power 25906 total power 63098 so what have we got here now 95 506 health 79 508 protection 174 175000 170 yeah i can't do that i'll leave that to ranger speeds increased by 1 so it's gone up to 143 and there are the other stats okay when i started it was to say 
there was a battle. Here is the battle. I'm not sure. I I need to be able to tell the difference between Executrix and Chimera. Because they, they, they both look like flying bits of breed, don't they? So, um... <sighs> I'm seeing different strats. Maybe my strat's bad, but I target lock Bosk because I can come back, hopefully, as long as I can get a taunt away, I can come back with my tie advance. There you go. So that's why Bosk's in the starting lineup to get the taunt on to protect the other two. I've maxed out this ability on my scimitar. So here he is here. And the thing showing three is um, not being displayed. But that should be crit immunity for three turns. Now I'm going to bring in my Sith Assassin because it's safe. My Bosk is taunting. And go with a basic. Didn't land. Right, here... I know they're about to call in their reinforcement and that reinforcement is going to be Sunfac who's going to stun my Hound's Tooth. And because of that, I'm going to go with the basic. There's the basic. There's the Sunfac. There's the stun. I'm going to carry on hitting Bosk. Definitely hit Bosk. Oh, great. I've now got the healing immunity on Bosk. No, I haven't. I've got it. Oh, yes, I have. It's Hound's Tooth, though. Come back. This is why I saved Vader's special. Ability block their Sunfac. And their Bosk, or sorry, their Hound's Tooth is still taunting, so we can still keep hitting that. And I'm hoping that... I can do the special and make this hound's tooth disappear. Can we? Yes, we can. Now we can just start focusing 100% onto the geos. And here comes my second reinforcement. And I'm going to do the AOE and give them all some additional thermal detonators. Uh, okay, because my advance isn't buffed. Oh, I didn't expect to one-shot their Vader. Keep hitting, hitting, and now they're protected again. Get rid of Yules. G and Ocean Spy next. Let's lock him in do the buffs get rid of yules big hit from vader for the win so that's it my houndstooth crew member has um been buffed a bit and a ship battle too thank you for watching